Assalamualaikum guys, Irfan back again with another video and this time I'm going to show you a needle trick. All of us are familiar with the uh, charts that you can uh, make in uh, in Excel and all of us must have used uh, the charting capability at some point in time. Uh, what I'm going to show you is uh, what is, you know, what are micrographs or spark lines as uh, Excel likes to call it. Uh, these are graphs that fit in one cell and they work on one row. Um, so let's see uh, what, what, you know, what this entails. Uh, what you have on the screen is uh, the, there's, a, you know, there's a, a company that has various uh, outlets. Uh, you, know, you can call it like a stores or outlets all over uh, the city or state. And every year, you have some new outlets that have opened up but unfortunately some outlets may have gone out of business and so they may have closed so at the end of the year what is the total number of outlets so for example uh, let's zoom in a bit here uh, in 1990 at the beginning of the year there were seven outlets nine new outlets opened up two closed down so at the end of the year there were 14 outlets now these 14 outlets would be the opening uh, number of outlets for 1991 and 10 new outlets opened up uh, but unfortunately 12 closed down so the meaning were 12 and so on and so forth. Now say for example for each year what you want to do is do a, you know, a line graph of the exist the opening and the new the the number of outlets closed and the total outlets. So how would you go, go about doing that? Let's see. So what we'll do is we'll highlight this data portion. Okay. Click on insert and then spark lines and we will select line. So it says the data range is E4 to H13. E4 to H13 okay now where you want these graphs to show we're going to have them show up over here okay so from C4 to C13 and click on OK and there you have it those are graphs for each year now you can um, do some formatting on these if you go to uh, you know this part here, uh, marker colors. Let's first put uh, markers. Uh, let's put them in red, say for example. So you see how now you have these markers showing up. So this is 7, 9, 2, 14. So, the, and as, as I said, th these are graphs that just sit in one cell. And then there are different little, uh, things that you can. Uh, uh, use in your presentations to increase the impact of the data that you have and I hope you enjoyed this little presentation uh, for this uh, needle uh, uh, thing that you can do in Excel and if you'd like to see more videos like this uh, please subscribe and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up thank you